All right, so it looks like we got some pretty crazy news today. Um, obviously, this is something that we all saw coming eventually, but I didn't think it was going to be this soon. Um, of course, I do apologize for being a little bit late to the party. The reason for that is because I was actually hosting a housewarming slash Christmas party, and uh, everyone just left at around 2.30 a.m., so this is my first chance to really record a video. But, uh... Yeah, let's just get into it. Let's just get into it. Um, we got a new producer's letter on the official global Dokkan Twitter page slash uh, Instagram page. And there was some very interesting stuff that was revealed here. So starting from the top, we have, of course, Koto, the global producer. And she says hi. She says uh, we're going to be talking about some upcoming events, some results from the... Uh, vote from a few weeks ago, I think. And uh, yeah, let's start with the results first because that's what she talks about first in the video. So we had uh, one question, which was, uh, what's better, basically, link levels or skill orbs, right? And uh, the answer should not surprise anybody. 81% voted for link skill level up or link skills being better and skill orbs for powering up a character, right? So that was the first question, and the other one was a vote between which character we want to see Extreme Z awaken first, the LR Godku or the LR Whis and Beerus. And as expected, 74% voted for the Godku and 26% for Whis and Beerus. Of course, eventually, we will get the Beerus and Whis uh, Extreme Z awakening as well, but right now, it's going to be the god coup first and uh, yeah based on the results of this um, survey essentially we're gonna be getting the return of the uh, elder guru or grand elder gurus uh, guidance event I think it's called yeah guidance event right there uh, which is obviously a really good event for increasing link levels and on top of that we are gonna be getting the extreme Z battle and extreme Z awakening for the LR Super Saiyan God Goku uh, in February, I believe. Let's see. Uh, yeah, they said, or she said, that the LR Godku Extreme Z Awakening is going to be February 2023, so we got to wait a few months. But the Elder Grand Gurus event will be available uh, later this month, so probably, you know, sometime next week, right? So that's awesome. And uh, I think the Extreme Z battle should be global first. The LR Godku Extreme Z Awakening should be global first, uh, but who knows, right? Either way, if it's global and JP at the same time, I'm completely okay with that. And uh, from there, she talks a little bit about burst mode. Um, at this point, most of you guys have probably, you know, tried it. You know about the uh, glitch on global with the friend lead that's like completely broken, but. Um, aside from that, she talked about just like what the mode is about, um, you know, what, what it's for, uh, the fact that version Z is basically over now. This was the last uh, update for version Z, but they will continue to improve the game, of course, in the future with further updates. And uh, yeah, some more, some more stuff about burst mode right there. And also the burst coins can be used for, uh, you know, buying OSTs in the game, but also for buying things in the Baba shop as well. And now for the very exciting part, for the thing that's getting everyone, uh, you know, extremely hyped at the moment, and that would be the upcoming Dual Dokkan Fest for, hold on, let me just find it in the video here. I don't, I don't wanna skip through it, but uh, yeah, she's getting to it. She's getting to it. Movie collaboration campaign part three, which is going to feature. It's going to feature Orange Piccolo and Beast Gohan. Here we go. We're almost there. And there we are. Okay, so I'm just going to play this. But no sound, of course, because I don't want to get copyright strike to play. Beast Gohan and Orange Piccolo are officially coming, are finally coming to Dokkan Battle, guys. It took them 
a long ass time. It really did, but it's finally time, or almost time. Um, I don't know the exact release date of these guys, but I would assume end of this month, right? End of February, or sorry, no, uh, end of December 2022. Most likely, the animations for these cards, guys, uh, is beautiful. It's beautiful. I mean, if the cards look this good, just imagine what the super attack animations, the active skill, the entrance animation, all that stuff looks like. I mean, it's just... It's freaking glorious, man. It, it's glorious. Um, I, I don't know what else to say. I don't know what else to say. They're coming, guys. Um, whether you're ready or not, whether your stones are ready or not, whether your wallets are ready or not. And uh, get ready. Get ready. We have no details about what they do yet. We have no details about anything, really, aside from the fact that they're coming with part three. Obviously, we got the uh, card arts slash animations. They're both going to be LRs. It's a dual LR, dual Dokkan Fest. Um, but that's the extent of our knowledge right now, man. Uh, there is a little um, promo video here that... Uh, we can retweet for some rewards here, and um, we get like seven stones, I think, or something like that. Yeah, seven dragon stones and some other stuff, which is which is cool. Uh, so I'll play that real quick. Um, maybe I can play with let's play. With, I think I can play this one with sound. I think I can play this one with sound. So let me just pause my music here and enjoy, guys. And there it is. I'm pretty sure they would have played the Bandai Namco sound at the very end, which uh, would have been bad. So I'm going to rewind this, enjoy it without the sound now. Um, dude, it's, it's happening. It's happening. They're coming. Let me know in the comments how you guys feel about this. Um, do you feel like it's good timing? Do you feel like maybe they could have delayed it a little bit more? Or are you like, yo, about damn time, man. About damn time. They've kept me waiting for long enough. I definitely don't have a lot of stones right now. I'm definitely low on resources. But this is one of those situations where, like, I'm going to have to just suck it up and buy, you know, at least, like, a thousand stones plus. Uh, definitely do a stream. Definitely do a stream when these banners drop immediately because this is just too big you know to not do that i haven't been doing that recently i used to i used to do it a lot for like every banner release but i stopped recently and now we're gonna do it again because this is this is like as hype as it gets in my opinion you know for any possible new release they could do right now i mean beast gohan and orange piccolo is something we've been waiting for since the movie came out and that was was that like August or no July? Or I, I forgot exactly when they the the movie dropped, but like it's been a long time. The point is, it's been way too long, and I'm ready, man. I've been ready, and uh, yeah, that's all I really gotta say for now. Of course, once we get the full details and animations for these guys, I'll make sure to keep you informed in a, another video. But uh, for now, all I can really say is. I hope you guys are excited, uh, as hyped as I am for them, and I wish you the best of luck uh, when they drop. Of course, they're still a little ways away, but I'd feel really bad if anybody got shafted on these banners. Of course, it's going to happen, but I hope it doesn't happen to you guys, you know? So uh, that's it. Thank you once again. As always, if you like today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Uh, subs to the channel if you're new hit that notification bell so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and until next time have an awesome awesome day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out